So we're backstage right now at the Lincoln Center, uh, right before we go on stage. The process uh, using Living Algae for a Living Ink. Um, we're both PhD. Did I say that? Oh, yes. I'm already messed up the pitch. So there's a lot of different products we can make with this Living Ink, but the first one is a time lapse greeting card that literally grows and changes over time. This past fall, I was in a boxing match. I'm gonna come up with this dude. I'm about to knock him out. Give him a couple jabs on the left hook. Oh. The duck, dude. Come on. <laughs> right, right. Okay, let's do the answer. Right. Give him a couple of jabs and left hook. My shoulder pops out. From then on, I was having shoulder problems, and so I had to have surgery in February of this year. Good morning, everyone. My name is Robert, and this is my associate, Peter Ray. And we are? Memprint Dynamics, commercializing a new membrane filtration technology that saves time, energy, and money for the purification industries. You know how to spell my name. Don't you? <laughs> Don't give me that challenge. <laughs> My name is Chang Chen, and with me today is Tan Mei Telang, and we are here to solve the problem of poverty and pollution, both with one profitable business. My name is Willie Ogrizali. This is Tyler Cox. Few things are more frustrating than having an urgent legal or medical question with no way to get reliable answers. It's just too difficult to connect with a doctor or lawyer at just the right time. I'm Taylor Palmy, and I go to the University of Colorado Boulder, and I started Alkaline Clothing. The name is actually kind of funny. It comes back to the story of how Tanner and I met. Like, hey, you're in my science class. What's your name? Then I went home and looked them up on MySpace. She's creeping When away. that was still a thing. <laughs> The Blue Ocean workshops were really impactful in the way that we thought about our company, but also the way we thought about entrepreneurship. It felt more like a team, that we were all working together and trying to understand how we could all make each other better. We trust, and we know other people trust, CSU and the Blue Ocean Challenge as a thought leader. And Colorado is one of the biggest states as far as entrepreneurship goes. Winning today, it lends us invaluable credibility. And knowing that we're doing the right thing, we're on the right track, because if we lose, it's going to feel really bad. <laughs> Winning a Blue Ocean will help us to reach our first capital goal. We have $20,000 short yeah. right now to achieve our fundraising for the first phase. Yeah. And that's exactly where it fits in like a wedge yeah. for our requirements, this competition. We've just taken everything we've done for the past three years and put it just into a good format to present to the judges today. The last couple of weeks was intense. The most important part was just feeling comfortable and, and getting our confidence up and uh, I don't even remember the last three seconds before we went on stage so <laughs> I kind of blacked out there. The Blue Ocean Enterprises Challenge is really a unique business pitch competition here in the state of Colorado. Kurt Hoven and Kurt Richardson both felt like this was the time to do this and the College of Business at Colorado State was more than excited to become their partner. We've been talking about this for years, the two of us, about some kind of, of contest that really uh, brings entrepreneurialism alive in, in our town. And then we were going, okay, well, who's, who, what's the biggest, biggest contest out there? You know, and well, we gotta top that. We're also entrepreneurs at heart. It's, it's in our blood, it's who we are, and giving back to um, our kind makes a lot of sense to us. We wanted to get involved so that we can really um, encourage and support the next generation of entrepreneurs. A lot of great ideas emerge out of research labs at the university and come out of the classroom. Uh, they're discoveries that are made accidentally sometimes. When they're able to take that to market and start impacting the lives of consumers, uh, that's, in my opinion, really when uh, the game changes. Collegiate entrepreneurs are very unique. They bring a different kind of energy and excitement into the space that's so important and so critical for this cycle of innovation and entrepreneurship. Blue Ocean is engagement with the community. You get to mingle with the competitors. They're not just nameless companies. You actually get to see the face of behind and do like, hey, yeah, I'm entrepreneur too. The support has been phenomenal, especially considering what we are trying to do. Yeah. It's, it's really a friendly community in Fort Collins and we love this place. Pursuing your dream is the best life to live. Entrepreneurship, startup community is the best community to be in and we're so, we're so happy to be on this track.
We'll see if we can get a call. We hope to. Going home with money is better than going home without money. It doesn't just end with somebody walking away with $20,000 and $10,000 and $5,000. It ends with all of them getting out of this what they hope to. If it's investment that they're seeking, that they find one. If it's a strategic partner that they need, that they find one. If it's great training and great ideas that they found that I hope they found something out about themselves through this process. We definitely gave it our all and um, you know, no matter what, uh, we did the best we could do. There has been something to be gained for their startup that we've been able to supply them with, I hope, significant value that furthers their business in the direction that they're trying to take it. Competitions of this kind bring together the best and the brightest, and here we are all in one room at the same time celebrating innovation and entrepreneurship. Winning the collegiate track competition means so much. Not only does it mean these guys have taken home $20,000, they are now an enterprise track competitor. They are now playing with the big boys and the expectations are high and the stakes are even higher. And so for the company that moves on today, it's go time. Can I get a round of applause for all five finalists? This has been truly, truly amazing. When we first got into the Blue Ocean Challenge program, we were so excited. Then you go through the workshop, and then you get to the finals, and like, that's our victory. And then by the end, we're like, let's try to win. Third place, winning $5,000, is Memprint Dynamics. You know, it's, it's a really weird feeling. You're sitting there, you're, you're, you want to get third and second, sort of, but you really want to get first. So you don't want to get your name called originally. You want, you're waiting for it. There's nothing else that can make you feel that way. And the winner of $10,000 goes to Living Ink Technologies. So. Everyone's, uh, everyone's a winner, whoever competes, because this is such a good stage. It's such good feedback and it's such good mentoring. The real Gains is the feedback from the judges and from everyone at Blue Ocean. First place is going to get $20,000. They're going to get a year's worth of mentorship with the Blue Ocean Enterprises team and become an enterprise track competitor where they just might win $250,000. It's a very big deal. The winner is... It's phenomenal. We, we are really happy. We can't believe this is true. Yeah, I still can't believe it. Yeah, we've just proven our business model. It works in any kind of condition, so that really makes us feel proud. Usually we work in the lab by ourselves, so we're always like, is this a good idea? Are we doing the right thing? And so now there's a little validation there. You know, any business you try to start, there's going to be challenges, there's going to be obstacles. And there's going to be days when you feel like giving up. Giving up is not even an option. I, I couldn't even consider it. There's so much passion and love in the air, it's contagious. It powers us. So I think Colorado attracts positive people. It's, it's an exciting environment to be in because people are really forward thinking and, and collaborative. People want to shake hands, talk to other people, and figure out how to make the world a better place. The Blue Ocean Challenge is a phenomenal experience. I'm proud to be a part of it. Yeah. And so is Far Green. There's been so much support from the start to finish. We hope to really be able to return that favor because we're so grateful for it. This has been such a great thing to be part of and it's been so beneficial for us. Things have been incredible. I love this town. This year's just the start of some really amazing things in the future.